What's up, guys? So I got a little video for you today. Uh, so a player on the server, Mather, has uh, recently... I don't, I don't know if he's quitting or if he's just giving away his stuff. But he did a bunch of hide-and-seeks, and you know me being the hide-and-seek champion. I actually ended up winning 3.6 bill from his hide-and-seeks. Um, so I've been thinking about what, what should I do with that? Because obviously I already have the things I need. I got Tebow, I got Rapier. I don't... You know, there's, there's not a whole lot I need. And getting this much money for free is kind of cheating. It really is. I think that most people just... I don't know. There's different ways to play the game. There's, there's some people that just want the max gear no matter what as soon as possible without any effort. And then they want to go do stuff with the said gear. And then there's other people that like to work towards that gear. And that's the fun part for them. Not having the gears to work towards. That's kind of uh, where I float. I'd rather work towards something. So having all this money for free is just kind of pointless. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to blow it all. So how many mystery boxes can I get with... 3.6 mil cash. Alright, so what I did is basically bought untradeable boxes. So whenever you open an untradeable box, you get this right here. This can be exchanged for Tuckle. And with the Tuckle, you can buy a mystery box. And then these th uh, top items right here, the pest items, uh, can be given for pest control points. So it's a long, lengthy process, but you actually save money if you buy untradeable boxes and then mystery boxes rather than just buying mystery boxes. So if you want to save a little bit of money, put in more effort, go this route. If you want to be lazy, other route. Surprisingly, I decided not to take the lazy route, and we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna have to go exchange a bunch of pest control items. So we have uh, 66 total. All right. So I don't know what my last clip was, but I decided not to do the crystal keys. We got all mystery boxes. Let's uh, let's do it. These are all legit mystery boxes. We finally get to do a 100% legit opening. Already got a mahogany chest six. That's nice. That's really uh, one of the main things I'm going for is these chests. Obviously, the pet would be lovely. I would really like that, but, you know. I just got it on my other account, so who knows. Oh, that's a spoiler. I should have said that. Never mind. Too lazy. Just forget. Pretend, pretend I didn't. All right, so we got 63 left. I'll just open these live so you can see something because this video is not going to go long. Uh, nope. Nothing amazing. Um, it's, I'll give you a little recap. One Mahogany 6. One 3. One 4. Quite a few 1s and 2s. A $10 bond and four $5 bonds. So, all in all, I'm pretty happy. I'll definitely take that. Ooh, another one. Five dollar. And then... The last chunk. Boom. So... I mean, we got $35 in, in pretty much bonds. So that's pretty nice. I, I, I would say... I would say do it. YOLO. Was this worth uh, 3.6 mil? Uh... I, I, I would probably say no. But uh, if you got nothing else to buy, go for it. Let's redeem these. Let me open up all these chests because that is a part of it. Alrighty. Six. 35 crystal keys. It's probably one of the worst things you can get, but I don't really care. I'll take it. Oh, that's pretty poor. Let's just spam open these. Another five? I'll take a five. Let's open that. Uh, that's probably one of the worst things we could have gotten from it. And then we have one last batch. 14 Oaks 2. Well, I've completed a bludgeon for sure. Xanonite. That's nice. Oh, I thought that that was me. Darn. Uh, all in all, pretty good. How many poke points are we at right now? 48. Not bad. And then uh, donated points, 37. Not bad at all. Uh, yeah. Do it. Just, just do it. All right, let me do these uh, cash bags. So 13. Looking for 130 mil. 72 mil. I mean, that's that's like average. That's that's nice. I'll take it. 